So this bedroom, my son chose because even though it's a sort of smaller space, I think he thought it was the coziest. I always think a room, I want it to have something antique in it, otherwise it could just really be a hotel space or anything. And I had this lovely blue antique wardrobe and this beautiful Swedish chairs which are painted next to it. First of all, it had completely white walls and then I bribed him with 50 pounds to let me wallpaper the room in this lovely seaweed by Sybil Colfax. I'd had this made in our old home. I found this pair of Lithuanian curtains on eBay and then I got them lined with this stripe to make a bed cover. But then somehow I had to bring more blues in. So this Shashka by Volga Linen was just absolutely perfect. First of all, I did the balance and then I thought it would look so cool on this amazing blanket box, which I'm actually using to store all his Lego. It, I love the way it kind of melds with the balance and there's like an extension of it and it's in a real contrast to this woolly rug, which is actually from Siberia. And then all the different lampshade, upholstered stool as the bedside table. They all kind of clash, but work together somehow. So I chose the Sophie sofa because I've already got a Sophie armchair in my cottage office, which is a really small space, but funnily enough, this quite square style is very economical. It's got thin arms, it sits, you know, very on the outside of the space, and I wanted this to be the maximum space for me and my three children, and we can all sit here together and nipper. I really wanted a loose cover, because I just love the look of a loose cover. I've used this vulgar linen British fabric, which I love because I wanted to introduce the red somehow. You can see it then picks out all these other reds and looks really good with, this, the, with the Pimlico green. And I love the stripe because I love contrasting patterns. This is another vulgar linen pattern. This is a, a Colfax pattern and this is an antique thing and another antique cushion and just the contrast of them all together. 